Hi, my name is Lily. I'm a sophomore at the University of Delaware and I'm studying entrepreneurship and I'm originally from Westchester, New York. Uh, what about you? Hi, I'm Taylor. Um, I go to Appalachian State University and I'm studying exercise science and I am originally from North Carolina. Very cool. So the first question I'm going to ask you is how did you pick your current college and have you always gone to the school or did you transfer? So I um, only applied to a few different schools um, and I kind of picked this college based on the scenery. Honestly, um, we're in the mountains and I really, really like it here. Um, it's also like a really like safe distance away from my uh, parents' house. So, mm -hmm. um, and then I actually went to an early college high school. So I did my associate's degree um, at South Piedmont Community College. Oh, wow. Very interesting. So, yeah. So, uh, I'm sort of like a transfer student from there. To okay. Here. That's yeah. cool. I didn't know that they even like had programs like that. That's super mm -hmm. interesting. So, uh, is there like a career center or something on campus that helps with um, your resume or career advice? Uh, we do. We have um, a career center and we have, there's an entire building that basically deals with like admissions um, and then kind of like post-graduation and stuff like that. Um, and they have, they have a floor that will help you with writing and your resume. So yeah, we do have a lot of resources for that on campus. Oh, that's really awesome. So does my school. And I feel like a lot of universities. Yeah. So, um, what kind of resources helped you pick your major and, um, help you with career exploration or was your major something that you always wanted to do? Um, so Honestly, a lot in high school, we did a uh, test that like based on our personality would tell us like where we were going to go in life and like um, mm -hmm. what career we might choose and like our degree and stuff like that. So originally, I was really set on uh, being a biology major. Mm -hmm. And I thought that that's what I wanted to do. And then I realized I don't really like biology <laughs> that much. <laughs> I don't like biology class. Um, but exercise science is kind of similar with that. And I also probably my sophomore junior year of high school I got just really into working out and I was just interested on what was like going on in my body when I was working out um mm -hmm. so kind of just like finding myself through that helped me decide what I wanted to do with my major yeah I think that's really interesting too I like to exercise too and I think it'd be really cool to study that but you know yeah. you can only study like one thing <laughs> or like one, yeah. two at a time so you can't really do that but that's cool so um, are you, st so you're not still researching other resources because you kind of know that's what you want to do or do you know like what you want to do after your degree? Um, my plan right now is to become a physical therapist. Okay. So I believe that's what I want to do. Mm -hmm. um, I kind of, I think knew that I wanted to be a physical therapist before I knew what I even picked like as my major. Um, mm -hmm. So I'm pretty pretty certain in that but I'm also like just trying to soak up all the experiences that I can that I uh, get the opportunity to see different like occupations. Mm -hmm. That's really cool yeah and then I know we're all young so like even if it's yeah. something we do for a few years out of college yeah. it doesn't have to be forever so that's really good. So um, do you know what an association is and do you belong to any? Um, I don't know like the textbook definition of an association but I just kind of that it's like a cluster of different like um, companies or groups of people that are like focused on sort of the same thing and I am not uh, I do not belong to any. Okay cool yeah I kind of um, have the same idea of about about what an association is kind of just like a group of people who um, come together based off of a certain thing like a physical therapy association or whatever and I don't belong to any either but hopefully soon I will. <laughs> Um, so the next question I want to ask you is, do you have any internships or apprenticeships lined up? So I intern at um, a place right now. It's, called, it's just called a wellness center, basically, that we mm -hmm. have in the town that my school is in. Um, and I work with people that have cardiovascular and pulmonary diseases. Um, so basically, these people are generally over um, 60, I would say because mm -hmm. um, they are like chronic diseases and they come in and we basically create like specific workout regimens for them um, and everyone's unique and it's progressive and I believe each person gets um, 60 
days and they, they're supposed to come in three times a week. Um, and yeah. it's basically just supposed to, um, lower their risk for like future diseases and stuff like that and future complications with their chronic disease, um, and help them like maintain overall good quality of life. Um, a lot of people come in and are on like, um, oxygen and stuff mm -hmm. like that. And then by the end of their time at the wellness center, they're off of oxygen. Wow. Um, that's awesome. So just, yeah. So just taking things like that. Um, so yeah, I'm super involved in that. Um, and then over the summer, I'm hoping to, um, I guess like possibly intern or maybe observe, um, just different places that work with like physical therapists, um, specifically like the neuro side of it. So brain mm -hmm. and the spinal cord, stuff like that. Yeah, that's really cool. Thank yeah, you. actually, um, I'm in physical therapy right now for my back. And after just like seeing all that they do, and also like I work with athletic trainers, um, mm -hmm. or they work with me, I guess, I think that's really cool. And definitely, um, if something didn't fall through, or I had a little switch, I would definitely um, go back and like study and do the same thing. I think it's cool. nice. Yeah, yeah. So um, that's pretty much all I have to ask you. Um, so is there anything else you'd like to add? Um, I think that's it. All right. Sounds good. Well, it was really nice to meet you. So thank you. Thank you. Nice to meet you too. Have a great night. Bye. Bye.